one of the more popular defenses that has been coming kind of back into Madden for this year has been match coverage, cover four quarters, cover four palms, cover six. And in this video, we're going to be breaking down how to beat match coverage for one play touchdown. So we're going to be in bunch offset. This is in the Colts playbook. If you guys want to get my entire Colts offensive ebook, that's going to be available in our school community, school.com slash Cody Ballard. And basically, the biggest thing that I want you to do here <clears throat> is you want to put um, your fastest receiver in the slot receiver position, which we'll put Jamar Chase over there. He's probably the best receiver on the team. And you don't have to do that, but it's just helpful. And then basically, you can pretty much do this out of any play in the formation. It's going to be all hot routes. So we'll just do it out of corner out dig. So what we're going to do is we're going to put our tight end on a post. We're going to put our slot on a streak. And we're going to put our outside receiver on a corner route. Now, if you wanted to, you could drag this backside. I really like this route combo in general anyway. Um, and if you want to stem the corner down, you certainly can do that as well. So what you're going to see is match coverage is going to go, and the slot receiver is going to get over the top of the match coverage for a one-play touchdown pretty much every single time. Now, this is still a good route combination if they're in just a basic kind of drop zone coverage, and I'll kind of explain why it's good. It's good because they're going to have to switch stick to go guard this corner route. If they don't switch stick, this corner route will be open kind of in this little window right here, as you see on the sideline. So they're going to have to switch stick over to go defend that corner route. And the problem with that is if they switch stick over, now we're going to be able to leverage this simple high-low read in the middle of the field between our posts and our drag. So they switch stick over there. And now we're really looking for this post. I like to possession catch that in front of the outside third defender. And then if they, you know, let's say they, you know, switch stick over there and then they're also playing really good balance defense against your post, this is where the low read, the yellows will back up super far this year. And then you can just check it down to your drag route. This is also a good route combination uh, in terms of its uh, capabilities of beating man-to-man. -man. So if they're running man-to-man -man coverage on you, um, this is still a really, really good route combo because you have a corner route. You have, if you want to put a stemmed curl instead of a streak, that can get over the top of man coverage this year. And you have a drag route. So you just have good reads here, this tight end post. Let's see if we can throw that against man. Just got to catch the ball, but he is open. And then uh, the rest of the reads, you have this corner on the outside. This might not get open because it's T. Higgins going against Sauce Gardner, but normally um, that's not quite open. But then you have that drag uh, that you can kind of check down to. So really the best thing they could possibly do, um, in my opinion, is probably go to man coverage just because it's, it's decent. But this post route normally will cook. Let's see if it can get it here. And we're getting screamed at. Good old practice mode sheds are insane, man. I'll tell you, the, these practice mode sheds, are just the gift that keeps on giving. But let's see if we can hit this for you against man. And that time the drag fried, the corner fried. Normally the drag, um, and if you don't want to use a post, like let's say you're watching this video, like I don't really like how the post works because it's not the greatest against man coverage this year. You can use a stemmed uh, in route. You just need it to go over 10 yards, basically, um, in terms of this is how you're going to kind of get this to really cook match coverage. So if you want to use stemmed in routes as well, you'll see you just get a lot cleaner separation if they actually are in man coverage. But in general, this is one of my favorite plays in the game. And the reason why it's so good is because it can literally beat every defense, and it just cooks match coverage. Match coverage is going to absolutely get fried by this, as you can see. And we're just going to be able to hit this over the top for a one-play touchdown. Thanks for watching. To get the entire offensive ebook, make sure you join the school community, school.com slash Cody Ballard. A ton of content over on that website to help you become better at Madden and College Football 25. And you get access to everything for just 10 bucks. The link is in the description below.